Duty Advanced Warfare has dropped, and it made one thing very apparent. Warfare is going to be a game changer. How so? Well, we collected 11 things from the trailer that have us more excited about Call of Duty than ever before. We still have a lot of questions like, will these be in multiplayer, and how will this affect balance? But there's no doubt about one thing. We can't wait to find out. That said, here's 11 game changers in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Number 1. The Exosuit The first thing you see in the trailer is an exosuit and it seems like it's going to be a huge part of gameplay. Its basic function gives the player enhanced strength and the ability to jump extreme distances. Will you be able to melee attack from far? Will we be able to recreate the freeway scene from the Matrix? We're excited to discover the answer. Number 2. Wall Climbing it's not quite the wall running we've become accustomed to in Titanfall, but wall climbing is definitely going to change traversal as we know it in the Call of Duty series. It also gives the game designers a chance to add verticality to map design, something we haven't seen from the franchise. However, this does have us wondering if wall hanging will also be a feature. Let's try not to imagine what campers would do with that kind of power. Number 3. The Mech Suit Well, you're already going to be in an exo suit, so what could the designers give you to one-up another player? How about a Mech Suit with a Gatling gun attached? We obviously don't know if this will be a multiplayer, but it immediately made us think of the last Titan standing game type in Titanfall. Number 4. Invisibility Camouflage that makes you invisible has been in plenty of first-person shooters before, but this is the first time that COD has gone far enough into the future for us to see it in-game. We're not sure if it'll be a perk or if it'll be a reward, but we're definitely interested in the possibilities. Number 5. Infrared Grenades Now this is a big departure from everything we know about infrared in games. We can only assume that a grenade will have an area of effect limiting its ability, but a player that can see through walls in a highly trafficked area is going to be a force to be reckoned with in multiplayer. Number 6. The Lightning this power was a little more ambiguous, but it seems like it detects enemy movement or at the very least scans the terrain. We think it could be used to detect mines or equipment in an environment. We have more questions than answers for this one, but the blue light has us speculating and intrigued by its possible functions. Number 7. Deployable Cover Now that you or a teammate can throw down cover almost anywhere, we're guessing this will be essential to your survival on a hectic battlefield. It's going to make it a whole lot harder to score a point when your opponent is effectively using their cover to defend their flagpole or if they have set up a nice little sniper spot for themselves. Number 8. Hover Bikes Getting from point A to point B never looked so good. Not only do these bikes look fast, but they also look deadly when they're hurtling a barrage of bullets at anyone in their way. We haven't seen any vehicles in Call of Duty for a long time, so we'd be surprised to see hover bikes in multiplayer. Any big change to the series is a welcome one in our books. Number 9. Drones A much more welcome addition is that of new drones. We saw groups of them being deployed in what looks like a single player portion of the game, but there's one sequence when a female soldier tosses a turret drone into the air. That moment looks a lot more like something we'd see in multiplayer. Who doesn't want a little buddy following them around that would fill enemies full of lead? No one. That's who. Number 10, the spider tank. Not only did we see hover bikes in the trailer, but there was also a scene that showed a spider tank terrorizing anyone that got near it. Again, we don't know if this would show up in multiplayer, but having a speedy hover bike go up against a slow but powerful tank sounds like something we'd like to experience online. Halo's done it, why can't Call of Duty? Number 11, Kevin Spacey. We don't think that Kevin Spacey will be telling us to prepare for any kind of falls in multiplayer, but we know that he'll be a driving force behind the campaign. Having an actor of this caliber gives us tremendous hope for what the story of a dance warfare is going to offer. We already know that Spacey can play a convincing and scary vice president from his role on House of Cards, so we can't wait to see what he brings to the role here as a villain. If it's half as menacing as Frank Underwood, then we're all in for a treat. The footage ends with the tagline, Power Changes Everything, and it looks like that's definitely the case. We know the team at Sledgehammer is focused on Xbox One, PS4, and PC, but how much is the new Advanced Warfare going to change the winning Call of Duty formula? And will it be for the betterment of the franchise? Only time will tell. For more on Advanced Warfare, you're already in the right place. IGN.